Navigating Boston's snow-filled streets is a hassle for everyone. But for parents with babies, simple tasks can turn into hours of backbreaking chores. Everything becomes just that much harder with the snow um, and the baby. It's like having two babies. <laughs> Like many other stay-at-home moms, Katie Olson has largely given up on going out. But this weekend is her daughter Lizbeth's first birthday party. So Wednesday she went grocery shopping. A lot of the times, you know, people will get very judgmental about taking a baby out in this weather. If you want to eat, if you want food, if you want to pay your rent, you have to get out of the house. And if you don't have the money to pay for a sitter, you have to take them with you. But it's a process. <laughs> You're okay especially using the stroller. It's a tight squeeze on the sidewalk, so Katie decides to walk in the street, but that's too dangerous, so she brings the stroller back home. When the shopping is complete, she walks to the bus stop with groceries in hand and in her backpack, while Lizbeth sleeps in her front pouch. It was a long day. Like, I feel like I did a lot, but when I look back on it, I didn't actually do that much. I just went to the grocery store. <laughs> Despite the obstacles, Katie says it's a welcome change from the snow days trapped inside. Your world is very small when you're a stay-at-home mom and there's all this snow, which is kind of preventing you from getting out to do anything. For the Boston Herald, Prisca Point du Jour.